today I'm going to review a product I've been using for a while. It's a Cobra radio. I use it for uh, communications when I'm on the road with friends, when we're traveling in a group. Um, I've also uh, used it for when I go geocaching and I've used it for uh, bike riding trips and whatnot so I can keep in touch with my, my friends, my colleagues, my family. Um, I've learned a lot about these radios. Uh, we are kind of in Canada here, we're kind of stuck. We have these low power FRS, GRMS radios that, that we get to use. The power output on these things is really shameful, to be honest. It's a 0.5 of a watt, so we don't have much distance. These things claim they can get up to 14 kilometers, I think. I think one person has to be on a mountain top and the other person has to be on the mountain top because if you have any kind of um, blockage of line of sight, these radios do not transmit or receive very far at all. But anyways, it's not, that's not the actual fault of the radio, it's the fault of the Canadian government and the fact that we're only allowed to put out between 0.5 and 5 watts on the FRS GRR, GRMS uh, radio frequency. It's, um, it's pretty sad, but we, uh, we deal with it, it's all we have, or we can go to the CB frequency, which is really old and antiquated. Um, we're not allowed to use these in our, we're not allowed to mount these permanently in a vehicle. We can't get a mobile radio on with this free license, but regardless, um, throw it on the seat and in your cup holder or whatever, and uh, away we go. Okay, I don't, enough of my opinion of my dribble of the Canadian government and the lousy uh, radio service that we're allowed to use, but on with the review. The product itself is a as a Cobra MicroTalk G, uh, sorry, CTX425 radio, and uh, I believe that it's putting out uh, 0.5 of a watt on the low and two watts on the high. So we've got the we've got the frequency here. We've got the high and the low, and then we've got a call which actually sends a tone to another radio on the same channel. And then we've got the mode, so you can switch through your different modes. You got Vox, you've got um, you've got um, different call tones you can choose. It's a fairly basic radio, and these here are for your volume and for your your channel selection. And you go into your channel selection by clicking your mode, your lock. The radio itself functions all right. Um, I put this big knob on the back of here for my own use. I um the clip I did wasn't happy with the clip and I like to uh, put this on different belt loops and and whatnot and it just uh, unclips so the back of it comes off like that and then I can uh, put it back on it swivels uh, it doesn't get tied up if you're going through bush or whatever the radio itself functions okay. I'm not. Uh, I'm not going to complain about that. But I've, uh, through my uh, experience and through my research, I've discovered that uh, these have. This has uh, 25 channels on it, but but uh, high and low range, depending upon, is more about um, saving your battery, whether you're and when you're transmitting. So if you have it on the low range, you're only putting out 0.5 watts. If you have it on high range, you're putting out two watts. The more you transmit at two watts, the quicker you're gonna kill your battery. This came with um, four double A's, I think it was. Four triple A's batteries, but, but the batteries that came with it didn't last very long. They were rechargeables, but um, the, I wasn't too impressed with the life cycle of the battery itself. It wasn't, didn't last as long as I thought it should. The the radio, I have, uh, I've had two of these. You buy them in a set of two. I only have one left. Uh, I gave one to my ten year old, and she was in the playground with it, and uh, she brought it back and says it doesn't work anymore, and I couldn't get it to turn on. I changed the batteries. I did other things to it. Um, it shut off and wouldn't turn back on, so I don't know if they dropped it in the water or I don't know. 
I just stopped working one day. But anyways, all in all, uh, it's a pretty good product. Uh, it's okay. Me, it's it's okay for for the um, quick and dirty, and and it's uh, they're only sixty nine dollars. So on the website, and you can probably get them on sale in any big box stores that sells the Cobra products, the outdoor stores. Um, in Canada, we have Canadian Tire, uh, Walmart, and I know that's all over the place. I've seen them for sale on Walmart. Uh, this is still a current model. They're still um, they're still selling this model in the stores, so it's not like it's a discontinued item as far as I know. I've seen it in the stores. I've seen it in stock. But I, uh, I was looking for something a little bit better and a little bit more features. So I uh, I still use this one, I still take it with me. I carry it with me when I go, mostly when I go four wheeling. I, this is the one I put in my belt loop and I pack this one around. And uh, so I have truck to truck communication when I'm walking around uh, on my you know, bipedal, hiking around the trucks or whatever. And so I'm still in contact with my, my friends if I'm spotting or whatever for four wheeling. But uh, overall, not a bad product, other than it that one failing, and I don't know why. I don't know when you gave it to your kid, and the kid dropped it in the water, but or something I don't know was dropped. That's the story I got. Where it was dropped into, it's beyond me. Anyways, that's the Cobra and uh, the Micro Talk, and and it's a it's not a bad little radio, but I have upgraded, and uh, I upgraded to this one. This is a uh, this is another video that I'll be putting on YouTube. This is uh, another product review, so uh, watch for this one to come up. I'm just gonna keep this one short, and uh, I'll be talking about this one in the future. This one's a much nicer radio. It has uh, has way more features, and it has actually has more power output. But I'll get back to that in a minute. Okay, thanks for watching, guys. Please uh, like and subscribe and and uh and communicate yeah share that's a form of communication so thank you very much for watching my video i uh, hope you enjoyed it and uh, don't be afraid to comment or or whatever thank you very much bye now